Hi and welcome back to my channel. My name is Tina and today I'm going to be uh, decorating and scheduling out my second week in December in my dashboard uh, classic. Now I did start out December with um, some wintry kind of spreads in that foot. Today I am feeling a little bit more like fall. So I'm going to do one last hurrah for fall, <laughs> even though it still is technically fall, but we are headed into winter weather. Um, I have the Agenda 52 seasonal foiled, um, and I have this sheet here that I'm going to primarily work out of. And I've got um, a couple others that I might pull some from. And then I have the Happy Planner Essential Seasons that I can pull some uh, fall, and I think that they'll match quite well. Um, as far as boxes, I'm, I'm thinking I might not use boxes this time. So we're gonna see how this goes. I might pull over some boxes to <clears throat> use up here, but I am not so sure that I want to do that. I might just find another way to separate this out. Um, let me take this off because my sweater is getting kind of warm in here. It's it's really cold outside though, but the wind is blowing like you would not believe. So I think I'm going to start over on the left side this time. Um, if you are new here, I am primarily a functional planner first and foremost, but I do use decorative elements. And sometimes I just get a little crazy. I have lost my white out. There it is. Okay. Sorry. It's on the other side of my desk. So I'm going to get rid of the words here. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do up there. So I'm going to leave that alone for right now. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's definitely a day. Um, okay, so this says make time to enjoy all the simple things. I don't want the fall, y'all, and things like that. So, I do want the lighter color. Let me see what I got. So, I used all the boxes out of here. And I think that is all of the fall. Yep. Okay, so that's the rest of the fall. This, oop, come on. The Agenda 52 book doesn't have boxes but they do have some nice things that can be layered um so i think oh i don't have any uh I'm going to just eyeball it because I don't have anything to lay this down on right now. And I'm going to line that up right down there. I just kind of want to bring some of this stuff out um, and use the stickers that I have, of course. Where do we have? Okay, so we have these. So I'm going to use, I think, a brown one. Here, I'm going with a different style of function this this um, go round. So, nope, it's one back. Okay, so we have all of the um, get it done, important, all of that. I also have some washi tape that I think I want to use and I'm not sure I think I'm going to do I don't want to get too crazy <clears throat> let me see I can pull out the gray and the white and the black and that one has like a green I don't like it but hmm. see these are like really thick 
and I know I can cut it, but I don't think that any of the, this is going to look great on any of that. Okay. We're going to try this dark brown and we're just going to see, I might end up tearing it up later. We'll see how it goes. I just want something so that it's got a little header kind of a thing to it. Nah, we'll see. Again, it may not stay. Um, so let's see. This says the joy. Joy is the beauty that blooms from the heart of gratitude. And I don't want that. Oh, nope. Don't stick to that. Okay. So I think I'm going to bring this one in here. This is fall in love with fall, but I think I'm going to do the similar thing and I'm just going to do it the other direction and eyeball it and hope that it comes out okay <laughs> because I'm eyeballing it and that goldenrod color. on the uh, margin on the spine there will kind of blend in and that makes it kind of nice. Um, so I think that's all I want to do with those at the moment because I think I might put another list here instead of having this right here. I think I'm going to shift things over, but we're going to, where did it go? Uh -huh. We're going to move over here with the fall stickers and see what we can do. Because I know got that one. We have some fall ones, but I like these little flags up here at the top. And I'm just going to take these out because I might just tear this book apart and put some of my holiday books together by holiday season. It just makes it easier to coordinate colors and things. That's more of a Halloween, but I kind of really like these. And I don't think this is an easy week for me, meaning that it's a very light week. There's not a whole lot going on. So all I need is, let's see, we don't have class anymore because classes are done. So I don't think we have anything on Mondays. The guys do have dart balls, so I do want to mark something down. My husband has an appointment here. Um, so I'm going to take this one here. I'm going to put this up in the corner. Just so that I have a little um, thing there. So, I really wanted to use this sticker sheet because it is so adorable. Um, I haven't quite figured out what I want to do with all of it. So I think I'm going to go up here with the houses and the wagon. So maybe here with the houses and the wagon. Because that little wagon is super cute. Oops, there we go. Oh no. Oh, this is one of those misprinted or miscut sheets. Oh no. Ah, okay. There goes that one. So we might just be using some other stuff. Oh no. I forgot. I didn't pull this one out. Oh, I think I remember this because I was so upset because the ladder. Yep. The whole sheet was miscut. So there goes that one. And it is an older sticker book, so there's really not much to do. Um, I am going to take this one and I want to cut the gold off because I don't want the shiny gold. So sometimes when we make plans with what we have sometimes it changes because of other circumstances <laughs> but we can still do it i can hold it right there we 
we go. I know, I just dropped that down. Get those over there. And I think I'm going to do this over here because the kids are going to the movies, I think. And I know it's not perfect, but kind of just even that little edge kind of just gives it a little sparkle. So we're just going to leave that. So I think this is the Friday that the kids are going. I've got my son and my daughter decided to go see Moana 2 at the local theater. So um, I am going to use my tweezer. There we go. So these are going to be really cute. And I just realized I went to the grocery store and I have things I forgot to pick up. So, yay. Okay. So there is that. Those are now gone. Those are so cute. I like those lights. If I could get like a full sheet, that would be great. Um, stay down. Okay. So I don't think there's anything else on this sheet that I really want right now. But I have this one if I want to use any of these icon flags, but I don't think I want to. Um, and we have these. Like I said, I'm trying to stay away from the words like fall and things. I'm just trying to give it a fall like feel with what I have left. And this is like a Thanksgiving sheet. Um, so I think that, let's see, and this has definitely got fall stuff. But as I said, it... It can or it cannot. How about it's finally sweater weather? I don't know if I like that there. We might just put that back on one of these and I will look into that, but I do. Okay, so this one is pretty much done. I am going to bring these over. And it may look a mess, and it more than likely is right now. Um, I think I'm going to indicate the boys' schedules here with these dots. If I can get them off. Come on. There we go. If you're new here, um, my boys have some interesting work schedules, so trying to keep up with who is where and who will be home for dinner and when they can do certain things um, to keep their schedule here. And I think even after my oldest is going to move out after Christmas. Um, I don't know if it'll be New Year's or right before New Year's, but he intends to move and his best friend already has a uh, apartment. So they're renting it together and we will be moving him in the near future. Uh, so it will be definitely, definitely a... Um, big change in our household and the dynamics of things. So I think I want to put another list. I think I'm going to start at the top here. I don't love how these things don't line up. It's 
still don't line up. All right, good job, Happy Planner. Um, there we go. We'll just have to deal with that there. Okay. And then I think I'm going to put one here. Maybe we'll put a light one. Okay. Okay, so I don't love that. Well, I guess I don't need that much space, so maybe it'll be okay. Mm -hmm. I'll put it just on this side of the line. See if that works a little bit better for me, I suppose. And then um, I need to do okay, so this is a get it done. So I want to do a don't forget up there. And I think I'm going to do, maybe if I bring this, or no, not that one, this one. If I bring this around a little bit, and I can just, um, no, come on, go straight. Look straight-ish. If I do this consistently, maybe it'll look better. Trying to do it with the side of my finger. It's not working out well. There we go. I don't need it to go all the way across, so. I can put this down here to cover that kind of corner. And then I'm gonna use this one here, but I'm gonna rewrite um, over it and hope I don't look Hope I don't hate it, but we're gonna write dinners. So we'll see if that stays. <laughs> so I kind of want to bring some element of this washi on this other side just to kind of tie it together. And I might. Kind of bring that there. So I don't think I need too much, but if I bring it across, then it won't be so bad. Um, I kind of want something here to separate my lists, but I'm not sh for sure, for certain. I don't know if that. No, let's. I have not whited out this many boxes but if I can get rid of the boxes I can live with the lines and I can take this one kind of put it down here just to kind of fill that in so it's not like a random blank space out there um, floating all by itself. So I just want to look and see if there's anything else that I want to add to it because I think I'm going to add the always be thankful. And I know I cut most of this gold off, but it might, it's not too much. As long as it's not super flashy, I'm fine to add that there. So let's get this stuff out of the way. Excuse my reach. And let's see what this looks like when we get it in and put together. Okay, so that looks pretty good. I like this. Um, and I'll show you kind of how I use this. Obviously, these are my to-do lists and these are my dinners. So I will actually probably just list them out. Oops just list them out. Usually I put like, you know, an MTW kind of thing. Um, this I will put one child and the second child. And then we have a doctor's appointment. I don't think I have, do I have appointment? 
Oh, I do have appointment stickers. So I'm um, going to take one of my appointment stickers and put it on top of this clipboard so that I know what it's for. And then I'm going to put uh, R and R. Okay, and then I'll just fill it in with the rest of my schedule. I'll just put doctor appointment and I'll have to look up what time that is. Um, but there it is. That gives you an idea of um, how my weeks generally go. If you like seeing, you know, this obviously is not a very heavy week as far as like scheduling and things. But if you like to see how I use my planner and my layouts, uh, drop a comment down below and maybe I can see about getting some more videos done like that. Um, in the meantime, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.